Hello there people. Today I'll show you how to make a dubstep growl like you heard in my dubstep tutorial. Here we go. Choose the notes you want. Then, let's move to the sound designing. Opens in add sub FX, and set the frequency to 128. Go to show voice parameters after adjusting the amplitude. Choose any wave you want for the voice oscillator. Turn on the FM and play with the octaves of both the oscillators. Play with a mod amp. You can add unison at low detuning for a wider sound, but make sure to choose odd number of voices so that your main voice stands out. You can adjust the voice by messing with the frequencies. Always keep on experimenting, who knows if what you might end up with would be a dope Skrillex-like sound. Increasing the main resonance increases the highs. Now, let's EQ the sound. Remove low frequencies if the sound has sub-bass frequencies and also remove some harsh frequencies mainly in the high region. Compress the sound by adding on, which is the best plugin I've ever had. It transforms dull sounds to crispy and interesting ones. Add distortion. You can choose the factory ones or third party plugins, doesn't matter until it sounds good. Though, I'd suggest crossover distortion. Now the main plugin, that had formed the growl. Increase the resonance for more vocal like effect. Set depth to 100%. Automate the frequency after you've found the sweet spot. Automation in LMMS kind of sucks, I wish it was more easier to get the desired automation, but anyways, you gotta work your way through it until you feel like it's sounding like you wanted it to. Mm -hmm. 
add another odd to nullify the bad effect due to the one. Add low pass filter to avoid highs during the low frequency in one. Automate it and try to put them in phase for perfect sound. You can automate resonance to have more control over the growl sound. So, here you are, with the growl. Now you have an idea of making growls, so you can make your own by adding your taste and creativity to it. Like the video if you learned something, comment, and subscribe to have more tutorials. Thanks.